Hey, what's going on guys? So I'm going to show you how you can screen mirror your Android phone, doesn't matter what Android phone you have, onto your Sony Bravia. Now this Bravia, Sony Bravia here, this is old. This is a non-smart TV. I bought this back in like 2010, I think it was. So it's a very, very old TV. And I'm going to show you how you can pretty much screen mirror any Android phone that you have, and it doesn't matter if it supports Miracast or not, okay? For example, here's the Samsung Galaxy J7, and here's the Samsung Galaxy J5. Both of these phones do not support Miracast, basically screen mirroring. However, I'm still able to screen mirror it if I use a device called Chromecast. What's the difference between these two? The second generation is a little bit faster. Which one do I recommend? Get the one that's faster, not only if it's a, it's a little bit faster, but it's only five or ten dollars more. But either way, both of these work exactly the same way. And in this TV here, I actually have the Chromecast 1 that's hooked up to it because I have Chromecast 2 that's downstairs on my other TV. So let me show you how this works. Grab your smartphone, and when you install the Chromecast, you basically it looks like a dongle like this, and you just put it on the back of your HDMI port. Make sure you go, once you hook it up to the back of your TV, that you go into input or source. Make sure it's on the correct HDMI port. Mine's on HDMI 3. And then what you need to do too is you need to download this Google Home app. It's a Google Home, okay? It looks just like this. I'm going to tap on that. And then what you do from here is, let me go back here. So as, as soon as you tap on that app, what you want to do is you want to tap on the three lines here. Tap on the three lines, and then you want to go down to where it says cast screen slash audio. Tap on that, and then you can click OK here. And then you want to pick your Chromecast. Mine is, this one here is 4702. This other, other number here is the one that's uh, downstairs on my other TV. So 4702, I'm going to tap on that. Give it a second here. Voila, we are screen mirroring here. Super simple, simple. We can look at apps, we can watch YouTube videos, we can view our photos, videos, presentations that's stored locally. Like let's go into our gallery, for example, here and I'll show you some photos and a video as well. So here's a photo here, some VR headsets, DSL camera, and here's a video here. Let me play this video here. And the thing is, the volume that's on here, if... Six, seven, eight, so basically once nine, I play... Ten, so once the volume is on, the volume actually comes out from the TV. Okay, and of course we can do everything else. Anything that we look at is going to be... I mean, we can play games here. Uh, we can go to YouTube. Let's just, let's just go to YouTube. Let me tap on YouTube here. Let me put on a YouTube video. The thing is, the, the great thing about Chromecast... Hey, doing today. So today I thought uh, I'd let, give me, you let me lower this down. Video the great thing about Chromecast is, you know, there's, a, there's thousands and thousands of apps that you can uh, cast with. It's, it's a difference between, like, casting and uh, screen mirroring. But, like, apps like YouTube, uh, Netflix, Hulu... You can cast those instead of screen mirroring. So right now I'm screen mirroring, but why would you want to cast instead of screen mirroring? If you can, I mean, you can't cast local photos and videos and presentations and, and a lot of other apps you can't cast it. But YouTube is something you can cast with. And why would you want to cast it to a screen mirroring? Well, because first of all, you have to leave your phone on in order to screen mirror. If I go ahead and turn my, put my phone to sleep, then this is going to go off as well. Another thing is too, if you're watching like YouTube or Netflix or whatever or video, you have to keep your phone on, and that's going to kill your battery juice on your phone. So you're better to cast it. Though. So how do you cast it with Chromecast? Well, check this out. You can see the casting icon right here. Just tap on that, and then we're going to select the 4702 Chromecast again. And right now, I'm going to be casting. And now, what exactly is the difference, and why is casting better than screen mirroring? Well, let's give this a second to uh, load here. Oh, let me press on play. I'm going to play the same video here. Okay, so now I'm, not, I'm casting, okay? The video's not playing on my phone and on the screen. It's just playing on, the, uh, on my TV right now. So check this out. If I put my phone to sleep while I'm casting, this is always going to play in the background. 
Also, I can browse my phone. I can open up other apps. I can check my email. I can make phone calls. I can send text messages. All while this is casting in the background. So that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions, uh, just comment below and I'll, I'll help you guys out. And I'll show you how to disconnect from casting. So I'll just go back to YouTube here and I'm going to click on that casting icon again. And then I'm going to click on stop casting here. And there you go. Pretty simple. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.